Hey up guys and girls, guess where I am? Back up the coast, we walk kid. <laughs> In his Miltech tent, yeah. Just an overnighter, eh? been here many times, wonderful place, and you'll never guess what I'm having for my tea. What do you think I'm having for my tea? <laughs> my little uh, tiger paws there. And our kid, he's only 73, look at him silly old get, wants to start camping. <laughs> Miltech tent, eh? it's a little belter and all, I'm impressed with that. Oh bloody hell no, oh no, what we got going there? What we having kid, bacon and beans? We're cowboys you know, we're having a bacon and bean tea. I think we ought to be on wagon train, that's all we ever bloody eat is bacon and beans. But, it's a wonderful day. It's a wonderful day. And uh, we've got here all right, and uh, I'm having a lift installed for our kid to get him back up that uh, up that hill where you can see there, like, yeah, so I struggled a bit with that. But yeah, so it's nice to get out, I haven't been out for a while, but um, this is our kid's first time since he was 12. <laughs> I haven't been out for 60 years, <laughs> his missus has kept him since in. Since a boy scout. <laughs> since he a boy scout. Right then, I'll switch you off with, hey look, 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 beanie beanies, bakey bacon, Heinz means beans, exploding tents. <laughs> swearing. Catch you in a bit. Stop swearing. <laughs> Stop swearing. Stop swearing. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> That's our kid in his military tent. My brother being the stubborn so-and-so that he is, I've brought him a thermarest, a <laughs> trekker mat, and he won't have it. He's only got a bit of rubber between him and floor. <laughs> it's, it's not that, I can't get into a sleeping bag. <laughs> <laughs> and he says it's, <laughs> he says it's too much trouble blowing it up. <laughs> oh man, this is great, this, I'm enjoying this. <laughs> It's only, it's only 73. We ain't got much money, but we do see life. <laughs> oh. Come on, let's go have a look at Seaside. <clears throat> I think you've probably seen this view many times before, but it is nice. Sorry girls, bedding down for night. Yes, I know. There's all nests there. They're all in the nests. It's all right. It's all right. I've got them all panicking now. Shouldn't have done that, should I? They're all nesting. Not like look at them clouds. Up to now, it's been kind to us. I wanted to take our kid down, down there and in caves around the corner, but he's going to struggle to get down. Yeah. I've been here on numerous, numerous occasions. I never get fed up of it. I love it. I love it. <clears throat> I've probably told you before but that hole you can see down there is where they somebody in the past many many years ago has dug a, an hole looking for Whitby Jet and funnily enough when tide comes in it's, it's almost up to that hole but when the tide's out it's a hell of a way up to climb up to it 
but it goes in a long way, yards and yards. I've been told, like, it's the best part of a hundred years ago that that, that, were, that were dug in there, and it were dug with a bloody hammer and, hammer and chisel and a pick. No pneumatic tools are out like that. They were brave men, weren't they? They were bloody grafters, weren't they, them? Right, I think, well, I think our kids... <laughs> I think our kid's bedding down for me if he can get he can't get in his sleeping bag. <laughs> He's still struggling. Oh we're crying we're laughing earlier. It makes me laugh. Look, it's a bigger ass than me. <laughs> Good night. You're supposed to zip you're supposed to zip other one up first, Joe. Outer one. <laughs> Do you sleep in your glasses? Put them in my boots. <laughs> Don't break them. Slip them in my boots. Right. I'll close it up now. Our kid's in bed. What? I'm in bed. I'm in bed. He's in bed, he says. Yeah. And it's about five past going on for ten past ten. Uh, it's dropping dark. Looks a bit glum. But um, apart from that, we sound toasty warm. Yeah. So, go and have a good kip. Catch you in the morning, guys. The sky at night. Three thirty AM. It's a beautiful day. Dee, 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 dee. Six ten AM and we're packing away. Our kids had about ten minutes sleep with a stone in his back. <laughs> <laughs> but the stubborn so and so wouldn't have my blow up mat what I brought for him, so he'll have to suffer. <laughs> Look at that, beautiful. Yeah. And up to now, the weather's been kind to us. So, yeah, all packed away, leave no trace. I've got our kid up there. I'm going to take his pack up for him now. Uh, not back for 73. Yeah, leave no trace. That's what it's all about, isn't it? Sun's trying to get through. But it's been fine, so we're happy. Spring has definitely sprung. Look at that. Absolutely beautiful. Not him, not him, them. <laughs> Look at them. Aren't they wonderful? I love it. Have you come to Scarborough? 
Ask somebody where Scalby Manor is. The best breakfast on the East Coast. Eat as much as you want. 585 with a big pot of tea. Wonderful. Scalby Manor. Big campsite over there. But luckily, there's hardly anybody got out of bed yet, so yeah. Scalby Manor, Look remember that. that. Look. All steaming away. Absolutely wonderful. Our kids already tucking in, look. All that beautiful toast and marmalade there. Two wonderful ladies there, look, doing it all. Look, both smiling, look, both happy. <laughs> and it's a sunny day, we've got it all today, haven't we? Absolutely wonderful. This gentleman is responsible for all that beautiful snap we've just woofed. Look, <laughs> there it is, gone. We're on his toast now, thank you very much, sir. You're welcome. I've already said, if you ever come to Scarborough, Scalby Manor is the place for the breakfast. Can't be bets. Can't be bets. We love the East Coast, and why wouldn't you?